All right, guys. Good old boy 32 here checking out. So we're sitting out here in the Freedom Shack, and I bet you're wondering, uh, well, my favorite firearm, at least it's up there in the top five of, in my collection, is this guy right here. This is the Palmetto State Armory AKV. Now, after they got this thing cranking, I put about 3,000 rounds for this guy, and I've had one malfunction. One malfunction. This thing is so reliable. It is accurate as I'll get out. I'm going to do a side-by-side -side comparison of this with the uh, the uh, PSA AR9 10.5-inch barrel. But I'll tell you what, what we're here to talk about are my favorite upgrades that I've done to this guy. Now, um, I'm a big fan of quad rails. This is a drop-in by the company UTG. This is the UTG Pro. These things are made in, there in, uh, somewhere in Michigan. And I've got these things on several rifles. As a matter of fact, if I look over here, I've got a box that I've got packed away with a bunch of other things with future builds. And I'm kind of glad that uh, I've done some transitioning with this guy right here because some of the parts that came off this guy are going to go into an upcoming uh, AR-15 build. So anyway, what we've got is the UTG Pro. This is their quad well, so drop in. Uh, I had to do a couple little modifications. One, I had to trim off this little edge up here is extended out a little farther than it needed to. Little black paint, boom, you're good. But the nice thing is, is you've got attachment points for everything. It comes with uh, some three uh, QD attachment points right there. Pick rail all over the place. So pick this guy up there off of Optics Planet. If you are interested in doing this, just uh, go ahead. I'll put the link down below for uh, this thing. And you get 5% off with the uh, KB32 Tech discount code. KB32 Tech, 5% off. All right. So one of my other best things that I could tell you that if you've got a CQB type rifle, this guy right here, this is the uh, ACSS Cyclops from Primary Arms. One of the reasons I do like this is because if I'm carrying or I've got this thing stuffed in a, in a carry bag and this is for me to react in a certain way to maybe an event that may happen. I can tell you that I'm probably not going to be wearing these guys right here, which are corrected vision. If you have uh, some semblance of astigmatism, 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 this thing will square it away. So you don't have to rely on, on corrected vision. You just go ahead and you set it up and that guy the optic everything is absolutely perfect and the, the clarity the contrast is absolutely awesome i'll put the link down below for this guy as well or if you want just go on head on over to uh my website kb32tag.com all right so what does the piece to resist the yawns is that guy right there i've been waiting forever because i bought this thing when it was uh in this original form with the sba3 brace which is actually one of my favorite braces but for this guy this thing from uh uh what do you call those sb sb guys um anyway you know who i'm talking about good grief my mind's going crazy this was what I wanted for this firearm. And as you can see, uh, it's very, very easy to install. Uh, and when it got, it came back on the market, uh, as first thing that I did was I went ahead and bought this thing. Okay, there we go. So anywho, um, now that that's secured, but you just lift it up, it swings to the side, and it gives you a very short platform. That's awesome. Uh, and, and yeah, 199 dollars is it better be awesome. I'll tell you that right now. But it locks up. It's very stiff. It's very nice. Um, just put that thing up and go to town, man. So that are that's the three upgrades. Now, what else do we have here? Uh, -da, this guy right here. This is an extension. Now, normally these magazines are only about well that uh long this is a 15 round magazine which gives you a capacity of 50 50 50 rounds capacity in this guy well get in there it's kind of awkward looking it's funky looking but you know what what an absolute awesome looking little firearm right now you pop that out boys and girls you're ready to go to town to protect your family and your property, right? So anyway, I just wanted to uh, show you what my favorite little additions and options are for the AKV. What an absolute awesome firearm. 
we're actually going to be doing a uh, comparison between this and the carbine length barrel. I know that my friend Pops Quest actually picked one up on the Christmas sale. I think he got the only one. Got a couple things that we're coming up with. Okay, I want to show you. Um, this is a 9mm happy stick. That's 45 happy stick. We got a really cool review coming up on a firearm. I can't wait to get back on the range and test it out. Ooh, whole lot of loving right there. Well, anyway, yep, those are my favorite little add ons for this guy right here, the AKV. Uh, if you got any questions, please don't ha hesitate in leaving them in the comment section down below. I look forward to answering those for you. But all I can tell you is this is a great firearm. It's, it's not cheap, but you will have a lot of fun. And with the capacity, the availability, guys, there's just nothing better in 9mm as far as I'm concerned. Let's go to Boy32. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. Support red, white, and blue. God bless America. God bless the men and women in uniform who uphold our constitutional because that's what it's all about. So 24-7 for our freedoms. Freedom's not free. But isn't that, isn't that just... Look at that thing. Is that not just bad? God, I love it. Anyway, y'all be good. I'm out of here. Oh, G-O-A. All the way. Good boy 32. Y'all be good.